Foundation, we're happy to offer resources and supports to help teachers and other educators in the implementation of the Kentucky Academic Standards. Today we're talking about a breaking down of standard resources and we're going to focus today on social studies and science for this professional learning support. The purpose of breaking down a standard resources is really to help guide teachers through this process of utilizing the components within the standards documents to gain greater clarity in what standards are asking students to know and be able to do so that they can meet grade level expectations. The purpose is also to ensure alignment of instruction and assessment to the intended depth of the standards. Now we always take you to our kystandards.org website where you'll find all of our resources under your standards resources. And once you click there, you're gonna see the general and the content area resources. Now today we're highlighting, or for this first section, we're highlighting social studies, but you'll also notice under general resources, there is a breaking down of standards icon. Um, social studies does not have one particular under there because their um, breaking down of standards resources actually found within one of their modules called Minding the Gap. So we're going to take you there to the social studies resource, which will then go to the um, social studies professional learning modules. And inside those modules, you'll find the Minding the Gap module. And just like all of those modules, you'll have a facilitator's guide, the actual module, and module at a glance. Inside this module, when we're talking about breaking down a standard, you will find tools such as this. Now, this is, this is the actual um, tool that has you to think about how you can unpack the standard and also to think about what's currently happening. But we're going to focus on uh, unpacking the standard. So in this, of course, you would be able to um, break this down by defining the language of the standard. You're trying to also determine the level of rigor that's needed or should be indicated through that grade level standard. We'll be able to analyze and translate the standard to better incorporate it into curriculum, unit, and lesson plans. Also, this is an, and this analysis is essential at the local level and at our schools and districts if the standards are going to be used validly and consistently. I, I wanted to also show this example, and so I just pulled up the um, section of that tool just about unpacking the standards. So you can see that. Um, this is the steps that APLC might go through to list the standards, to think about what knowledge, concepts, and vocabulary students need, what skills, and also what level of proficiency students need to be at to, endure, to reach this um, standard. There are, inside the Mining the Gap module in this section, there is a lot of support around how to do those things, and there are also links and other resources that are connected to those. Inside that Mining Gap module, you'll also find a support video that's just there to also help um, with this module and in considering the gaps and the instructional considerations that must be made. And so now let's take a closer look at the Breaking Down a Science Standard resource. To access this one again on KY Standards, you can get to it either underneath General Resources by clicking on Breaking Down a Standard, or you could also get to it by clicking on Science Resources in the content area. If you click on the icon under General Resources, you will see that we have three listed there, the last one being the Breaking Down a Science Standard. When you open that up, the front page is just going to give you kind of what's the general flow of getting to the intent of these standards. And it's going to give you possible steps that you could take. And then down at the bottom, you will see a link to a breaking down a science standard note taker. When you click on that, it's going to give you a graphic organizer that's going to walk you through step by step, looking at the different pieces of the science standards from the disciplinary core ideas to um, really looking at what can you see by looking at the clarification statements, what's in that assessment boundary, and then that bottom is really looking at what connections can you make to other standards and noticing um, the practices that are embedded as well as the cross-cutting concepts. In addition to this note taker, you will also see that it includes an annotated example of one standard using that note taker. So as always, if you all have any questions, please feel free to send those to standards at ky.gov and thank you for taking the time to listen today.